Today's top three headlines. Ukrainian President Zelensky is making a surprise visit to the UK today that he's going to be seeing um, Prime Minister Rishi Sunak, that he's going to be seeing Ukrainian and British troops training. Uh, we understand that he'll address Parliament, probably in Westminster Hall, I'd have thought, sometime uh, after lunch, maybe about one o'clock. Um... Looking forward to President Zelensky's visit today, not just for the symbolism, but also practical discussions on how the UK can help even further. My half-sister, who I hadn't seen for over a decade, and that was only for a day and a half, suddenly it felt like she was everywhere. Shocking, um, as you all know, and it just incredible, just such a display of projection, in my opinion. This morning, we know that three British nationals are missing and the Foreign Office's Crisis Response Hub is working to support the at least 35 British nationals. In a desperate race against time to find survivors, first responders facing major challenges on the ground, including below freezing temperatures, with snow and rain falling across the sprawling disaster zone. Tell the House that our 77-strong urban search and rescue team with four dogs and state-of-the-art equipment is due to arrive at Gaziantep later today. These men and women and these dogs of the LA County Fire Department are really gonna go place themselves in harm's way to save lives, 